hey you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl ebony all right you guys we are here to speak on a couple topics i know i'm a little bit behind on the topics but i am currently in another state so it took me some time to get started but there's a lot a lot to talk about so the first topic is none other than the rapper lotto getting accused of not only sneak dissing Nicki minaj but also sneak dissing ice spice but then in the end getting clowned after ice spice takes the main stage for a performance both women are scheduled to be at. Talk about a mess. Now you guys know New Music Friday is always something that people look forward to and Lotto decided to drop a freestyle. In this freestyle she said a lot of you know slick lines that made people believe she was dissing Nicki Minaj and Ice Spice. She told the following people don't compare me to Trent and she also said it's still giving coke. Lotto was literally using terms that people were using to discredit and to all also tarnish Nikki's reputation. Now after this happened, Ice Spice of course did not say anything, but this is where we saw, right, that there was a post for the wireless performance. Now as you guys see on the screen, during wireless, you do see Lotto on a different stage. But when you see main stage, guess who you see? Ice Spice. And people believe that Lotto's just bitter. Not only is she bitter that Ice Spice is coming to possibly take her spot, but she's also upset because she keeps poking the bear with Nicki Minaj and Nicki's pretty much not even responding. On top of that, Lotto is also upset because Ice Spice had allegedly met with 21 Savage and Ice Spice also had threw some shade after Lotto got into the altercation with Nicki saying that some of the new girls, well, they're just too entire and they come in and disrespect legends who came before them. After all of this happened, Lotto did unfortunately unfollow Ice Spice and the tension just seems to keep getting worse. But you guys will let me know what you think about it down below. But like I said, if Nikki comes back, Lotto, I don't want to hear nothing. You better get that 40 year old stuff in that booth and you better respond. All right, you guys, allegedly. Now the next topic I do want to discuss is none other than Chris Sean Rock and Blueface allegedly tying the knot and these two are now allegedly married. Talk about a mess. Over the past couple weeks, Chris Sean did announce that she was allegedly pregnant. Now there has been a lot of speculation that Chris Sean is not telling the truth. She even got into an argument with Blueface online where he accused her of sleeping with like 10 men and said the baby wasn't his. Now even after all the things that he's done, even during the performance interview, you know, at no jumper podcast where Chris Sean decided to kick over the TV and act a hot mess and also drink by the way um it seems these two decided hey with all this chaos let's just go ahead and elope and get married because we love the chaos together I do have a picture of Chris Sean and allegedly Blueface getting married go ahead and check this out ciao if chaotic it, that is like the last thing that I can think when it comes to this couple this is just like this is beyond a hot mess. this is like come on is this for the ratings for the new show like is all of this drama online orchestrated so that people can keep them relevant and keep them trending i just for me this is just a weird situation now people are reacting to this alleged marriage all over social media one user saying this what do we do to deserve this i promise we're sorry i love krishan but he's still entertain her so whatever she does to him or well he's selling her to the fantasy she want and he love the attention too don't let him fool you check the floor they got him rose mcgowan voice i'm overseeing them on the timeline can we please leave them alone and let them be? I don't know why y'all fall for every publicity stunt. Now, you guys, this could actually be a music video. I think that this is a stunt to get them talking. I do think that a music video is probably on its way. And I think that they're doing this to stay relevant at the expense of Krishan Rock's mental health and also Blueface's mental health. You know, it's so unfortunate. And I keep telling you guys again and again that I'm going to keep praying for Krishan Rock because this is a hot mess. There is nothing that we can say that's going to change this girl's mind when it comes to Blueface. So at this point, I think it's just best for everyone to just accept it for what it is because to be honest you guys this chaotic mess is making them nothing but money all right you guys let's go on to the next topic which is none other than the beautiful queen of rap Nicki Minaj making her return to YouTube and also explaining to fans what she wants them to do during her hiatus now you guys know Nicki Minaj has been missing in action on social media primarily when she does this she is usually working and coming back to step on next well it does seem that Nicki is on YouTube and she had a sweet message for her fans. Now, if you guys go under her song, Chun Li, Nicki Minaj is responding to fans and she said this. Thank you, mama. You guys are the best, hands down. The best is yet to come. Hold me down. Thank you, babes. So as you see, Nicki says the best is yet to come and she just wants her fans to hold her down, which she says all the time. I'm so excited, you guys, about this new era. And I know when Nicki goes silent, she's definitely working. I also want to address something.
editing i now have um this blog who makes videos on me even if i fart right and for them to make up this lie that um i'm not going to report on nikki you guys please when people say things like this especially if they sound like they're speaking in their you know bathroom don't even let it get to you okay i see so many messages in my inbox oh my gosh you're gonna stop supporting nikki when did i ever say that nikki's not online so there's no reason for me to make up stories to report on her she's also human and she's also a mother so i try to make sure that when i report on her it's something that you guys want to hear not something that drama people want to make up and gossip over you guys know we support the queen 100 over here and in 2023 i'm just trying my best to report things that show her in the best light because i want nothing but for her to win and you guys also see some of the transitions on my page with us not really beefing with people we're trying to you know level out the playing field if you know what i mean but i just wanted to address this because you guys are in my comment you guys know nikki or no one and i mean how many times are you gonna ask me at this point i mean it's been proven time and time again all right you guys now before we wrap up this video there is one more topic that i wanted to discuss that's been getting a lot of buzz and that topic is none other than may and the stallion allegedly with child you guys there is a blog that goes by the uncut and they allegedly are confirming that megan the stallion may be pregnant they're also saying that megan the stallion will make an announcement soon now here's the thing you guys not the plan b queen i don't know how much i believe this i remember a couple of months ago when megan the stallion was on the red carpet for bet and also um, before she did her swim shoot people were saying that she was pregnant then and she wasn't i don't know what this obsession is to get black women in this industry with children but at some point i don't think in my opinion that megan would do anything like this to jeopardize her career or maybe her and party are serious and maybe they are ready for a child but with all this drama with tori lane i don't know if that would be you know a good environment however i'm not here to tell anyone what to do with their body i don't know you guys i'm sure you guys will let me know what you think about it down below the fans are not here for it but you guys let me know what you think don't forget to subscribe to the channel give this video a big thumbs up you guys know i love you so much and we'll always talk very soon all right you guys you guys will get more videos tomorrow i love you and have a good night bye